So as I'm running out the room and going to the living room, I hit the hallway, y'all. Uh, all I know is I just feel wet carpet on my feet. Why are my shoes floating in my hallway in my living room? Stressed is like, if it's a word beyond stress, that's what I am. Babe, what's the word beyond stress? Because that's what I am. The word that's beyond stress? Yeah. Beyond stress. I mean, what word do we use? Piss the fuck off, not it. Huh? Piss the fuck off? That's not enough. Let me see. Uh, how about uh, irritated to the max, ready to blow some. Yeah, that's that? a whole bunch of words for stress. But yeah, we getting our luggage. Overwhelmed. Overwhelmed. Uh. This is our life. This is our life. This washroom. It's okay.
BLE gang back with another video. Today we are giving y'all an update on what has been going on with us. So, as you can see, we're not at home. We're in the hotel. Reason being. Okay, so um, I woke up and I, um, typical, well not typical morning, but I woke up tired, you know, been crying all night and I um, was just trying to catch a breather. But I heard the maintenance people out in the hallway. So I um, looked out in the hallway and I saw them trying to suck the water. Water was overflowing in the hallway. Um, so I saw them putting a vacuum over it, trying to cover it up. That's what they do in our apartment. They cover everything up. So they're trying to keep this problem on the low low. And I go in my bathroom and I see that the tub rise up with some old, ugly, nasty looking water. Like... It rises up. Um, so, as the tub grows up with the water, I go sit on the couch, and I'm just, he was in the room sleeping. I was um in the front room on the couch on the phone with my friend just talking. She asked me how I'm feeling and stuff, and we just sitting and talking. And next thing you know, I go in the kitchen to get something to drink, I think. And we had these real big jugs of water. So, I see all this water on the floor. I thought my baby pulled the tab and let the water just run all in the kitchen. So, I was just about to go yell at him about it. And as I walk out, I saw my whole hallway. I wake up to this bullshit. Oh, fucking love. Answer me, but I need to push this couch over. Um. Hold on, here it comes. This shit fucking stank. It's all the way up here. Johnny. All in the fucking kitchen. I'm fucking TV. Now, how we not fucking been here? But I saw the whole hallway filled with water. I just start screaming to the top of my lungs and I start crying because I was so frustrated. Like, this is another problem. And I start banging on the wall so he can hear me. All right, so boom, she started banging on the wall, yelling to the top of her lungs, I cussing know. and everything. So. I jump up out of my sleep. First thing I do is grab my guns. I don't know what's going on. I just hear banging and screaming. So as I'm running out the room to go into the living room, I hit the hallway, y'all. All I know is I just feel wet carpet on my feet, under my feet. So I walk a little further, I see all my shoes, like my shoes, my son's oh, shoes, her shoes, just floating. Like, why are my shoes floating in my hallway in my living room? So I look down, all I see is just big ass pool of water, like from the door the swamp. to the so kitchen to half half of the living room, like just literally all like you want you can just come in there and just splash party. I was heated. Like if you threw some ducks in there, they would have been floating on the water all through the house type shit. Like, we on the first floor. As you can see in the clip, though, it's just nasty. So, uh, what I do? I hurry up, grab the camera, take pictures, got the video. Reason for that being is I'm smart. I got renter's insurance. So, therefore, they about to replace all my shit. They about to fix this apartment up. They about to get this shit right. So, I go across the street to uh, talk to the apartment manager. And as I'm telling the assistant was going on and that I need to talk to the property manager. Now all of a sudden the property manager is not available. Which is a funny thing because she's always there. So, excuse me. But, so after that, they tell me, oh, well, you got to contact your insurance company and talk to them about it and then get back with us and we can handle everything and get everything straightened out. So, I talked to my insurance company and they basically told me that I had to write down all the damaged items. I got 20 things was damaged, 20 items was damaged in this uh, little incident. I mean, 
my Jordan Infrared 6s. Damage. My Retro 11 Concords. Damage. My Air Force One Lunar Boots. Damage. My Supreme Timbs. My Supreme Timberlands, y'all. And you about to read this whole list? Damage. My kids Jordan's damaged. Her boots and shoes damaged. Like our one of our cameras got damaged. Like so, we gonna be getting reimbursed for all that though. So, you know what I'm saying? If y'all ever get an apartment or when y'all move into a house, anything, make sure y'all get renters insurance because you don't know what's gonna happen. For real, anything happens. So make sure you got renters insurance if you want to be covered. But it's just a lot. Like. It was a lot to take in, like after coming from the hospital the day before and just just now starting to get back on our feet and then, you know what I'm saying, something knock us right back off of them. But, you know what I'm saying, we're going to stay strong, you know what I'm saying, it's not going to hold us back. We're going to keep doing what we're doing. We're going to keep giving y'all good content, you know what I'm saying, we're going to keep letting y'all know what's going on with us because y'all are fans, you know what I'm saying, we appreciate y'all, we love y'all, y'all like family to us, so we definitely going to keep y'all updated. You know what I'm saying? But it was crazy. It was real crazy. I was mad. I was definitely heated. And the whole complex definitely felt her wrath because she let it rain from the mountaintops. <laughs> I, I was... That had pushed me over the edge. I didn't care. At that point, I wanted to fight somebody. I didn't care. And it was the apartment. But yeah. At this point... Mm-hmm. But yeah, like, it's been a lot going on, man. We're just trying to make it through, trying to stay positive, you know what I'm saying, through all of this, plus on top of all this was happening in our city, you know what I'm saying, and everywhere else worldwide, it's just crazy times right now, y'all. Crazy times. But, you know what I'm saying, we still... Still stand strong, still doing this, you know what I'm saying? We still doing videos. Oh, we ain't gonna let it hold us back, y'all. So stay tuned, you know what I'm saying? If you're watching this video, like, comment, subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Tell your friends, tell everybody in the world. Go subscribe to Black Love and T, y'all. Because it's lit. Always gonna be lit. Anything else to say? No more sad videos. We're about to bring some fun videos. Turn up time. And be looking out for us in the lit house again. Y'all already know what it is, y'all. Lit house come on every Thursday, 7 o'clock. Eastern time. Mm -hmm. Tune in. Tune in.